This is just going to be a quick video showing you the worst Sega Mega Drive slash Genesis emulation I have ever seen in my whole entire life. So I brought this 14-in-1 um, game card off AliExpress about a year or two ago and it cost me um, $1.50 including shipping which was an incredible deal so I couldn't resist, I had to get it. Now I'm just going to show you how well the emulation works on this. Not sure how well you can see that that screen there. Yeah, that that looks a bit better. Now I'll just show you how um, it's got Metal Slug, which is the original Game Boy Advance game, which emulate uh, which runs perfectly as it's not being emulated. But all the rest are Sega Mega Drive games, or they might be Masters uh, Sega Mega Drive games, or they might be Genesis ROMs. I'm not sure. But we'll go ahead here and we'll play Sonic. Everybody knows what Sonic should sound like. But as you can tell the audio is really really slow. And as you can tell there it sounds absolutely like garbage. But I'll go ahead and start a game. And as you can tell, the game is running quite slow. And there is, um, and the audio is absolute garbage. Everything is loading slowly. Yeah, so that game is basically unplayable. But just to show you, it's not just this game that does it. I'll go ahead and um, choose another game. As you can tell there, the audio is not as bad as the Sonic game, but it is still quite bad. Yeah, so that was just a quick look at how bad the emulation is for um, Sega games you played on this game cartridge. I have actually played Sega Mega Drive games from a um, flash cart, Game Boy Advance flash cart, and they played a lot better than they play on this. I'm not sure what they're actually using to emulate the games from this on this card. Yeah, so I wouldn't recommend this card if you ever see one of these 14-in-1 game cards with um, Sega Genesis slash Mega Drive games on them. I wouldn't bother with it unless you can get it for like a dollar or two. Then I'd pick it up just for curiosity sake. But other than that, yeah, I wouldn't recommend this cartridge.